Welcome to this brief hypnosis and meditative track in which you get to be empowered to do the task in which you know that you want to do. And I know you believe you've been procrastinating. And I also know you came here for a purpose. So get yourself in a comfortable position as if you were getting ready to relax. This is not deep hypnosis. In fact, I'm going to use a combination of neuro-linguistic programming and hypnotic meditation in order to remind your unconscious mind how easy it is to do the task that you want to do. I'm sure you're aware that you've accomplished tasks easily and effortlessly before. And so as you relax, go ahead and I invite you to close your eyes and just familiarize yourself with the sounds around you. You may notice sounds in your environment, the sounds of my voice, and know that sounds will not disturb or distract you in any way. In fact, these sounds will simply remind you that you're not sleeping. You're resting. Just resting and allowing yourself to be lazy if you choose in this moment. Relaxed taking this time for yourself to recharge and rejuvenate and find the energy and motivation that you already have deep within yourself to accomplish that which you want to accomplish. And while you're listening quietly to the sound of my voice, concentrate for a few minutes on your breathing. That's right. Breathe slowly and steadily, just as though you are sound asleep or pretending to be sound asleep. And perhaps imagine just how comfortable you might look while you're relaxing right there where you are right now. Use the power of your mind and see yourself in your mind's eye. Use the power of your mind to do whatever has to happen to make you look even more relaxed. And as you think about your breathing, making sure that each breath in is the same length of time as your breath out. And each breath in lasts the same length of time as your breath out. Even though each breath in may be a different timing than each breath out. Just allow yourself to notice and focus. And while you're thinking about your breathing, Notice now the weight of your head against the back of your chair and listening quietly still to the sound of my voice. And as you listen to the sound of my voice, maybe you forget to think about your breathing. That's all right. I'm sure you're aware that the conscious mind only wants to listen to five things at once. And as you see yourself there listening to your breathing, you may notice that you can think of at least five things all at the same time. The sound of my voice, the steadiness of your breathing and the weight of your head as it feels heavier 
and deeper and how you might look from the outside. And that's four things. So now think of those four things while you're listening to the sound of the music in the background. This special music that helps your brain relax and easily refocus. So that's five now. And I wonder if you can think about those five things. And then, at the same time, notice the way your legs feel. And perhaps how your belly feels as you breathe in and out. And that's seven things now. The sound of my voice, the weight of your head, the music playing in the background, the way you look while you're relaxing, your breath, your legs, and your belly. And I wonder, I know you enjoy this time to focus on these things. And add an eight thing into all of that. I wonder if your mind is powerful enough to think of seven plus one things. That's right. Because in psychology, there's a rule called seven plus or minus two. Most people can think of seven things all at once, plus or minus two. And you can do it, can't you? I know you can. Perhaps feel the temperature of the room just to play, adding input to all of your senses, hearing the sounds, seeing yourself, feeling the weight of your head, your legs, the movement of your belly. How you look from the outside. And notice how your eyes feel as you lay there, not quite asleep now. The music in the background, the temperature of the room, your legs, your belly the sound of my voice and of course when anybody thinks of all those things what you're really doing is scanning around them one after the other after the other so quickly so fast that it feels as if you're thinking of them all at once. In the world of computers, they call that time sharing. You are sharing your resources, your ears, your breath, your sensation, and the sight of you there, deeply relaxed between all the different tasks you're performing all at once. And that's why some people can only think of five things because it's the limit of their memory. Yet others, like you, 
can actually think of nine things. And I wonder now, I know how you like that. And now you can think when you simply allow yourself to think of only the most important thing at all. Concentrate your energies onto that one important thing, that task, which is going to be so easy to think of now that you're allowing yourself to think of only one thing instead of eight or nine. And that one thing is how good it feels to think of only one thing. Thinking how relaxed you can be now that you're only thinking of how relaxed you might like to be. Relaxing in your mind and your body and your sensations. No need to think anything at all, really, is there? That's right. No need to do anything. Nobody wants anything. Nobody expects anything. And there's absolutely nothing whatsoever for you to do except deeply, deeply relax. I would like you to take a moment now to think about all the things you have to do, your priorities, things you've been putting off, procrastinating, and allow your unconscious mind to choose one priority now. Choose one thing one priority that you need to accomplish. That thing that you've put on the back burner. That thing on your to-do list that's so important to you that you took this time now to focus and relax deeply to remind your unconscious mind how easy it is to do the thing that you've been putting off. And now you have that one thing in mind, don't you? No matter how big or how small it seems, in the next few minutes, you will find your reason to do that. I can tell that you've had a hard time doing it and you get to emerge from the session with the clarity, the energy, the ease, and the motivation to succeed. Yes. So notice now, why? Why do you need to complete this task? Why is it so important to you? When you procrastinate and you put off a task that needs to complete, what you're really saying is, I don't value my time. The energy and the time the procrastination drains from you is far more physically and emotionally demanding than the time and energy required to perform the task, isn't it? 
this is always true. The feeling you get when you choose to procrastinate is your unconscious mind protecting you. But the thing is that your unconscious mind was formed when you were very young. And it thinks it's keeping you safe. Your unconscious mind thinks it's being your friend by helping you procrastinate. But notice now it does not serve you. In fact, it prevents you from using your energy in the most powerful and productive way possible. So remind your unconscious mind now that your body and your mind are better served when it comes up with a way to do this now. Others have done it before and your unconscious mind gets to know that because others have done it, you can do it too. And that's right. Your unconscious mind gets to see that there's more comfort, more joy, more happiness when you let go now of any negative emotions that are protecting you from achieving this goal. So let's retrain your unconscious mind. Your unconscious mind is learning all the things all the things it's learning in two important ways. And the first way is happening now as I speak directly to your unconscious mind and explaining that it is so important to you that you evolve, that you learn new ways of living now. And it can come up with a solution to this challenge during this meditation or just directly after this meditation. But it gets to see the answer doesn't it? And the second way your unconscious mind learns will be happening very soon. You're going to show your unconscious mind through action that the tasks you've been putting off are both achievable and comfortably manageable. In fact, instead of overestimating the time it takes to complete a task, you get to break it down into small, easy, achievable pieces. You are time efficient and you understand clearly the time the energy and the effort required. And allow your unconscious mind to notice now how easy it is to start this task. How easy it is to continue. And the joy, the happiness, 
and the release of energy in so many positive ways that will happen when this task is complete. And that's right. Because when it's complete, it frees up your mind and your body and shows you how powerful you truly are. You get to do it today and tomorrow it's off your plate. That's right. Every time you accomplish something on your to-do list, no matter how big or how small, you are boosted by the feeling of pride and satisfaction. It builds your momentum and you feel physically lighter, emotionally lighter. You feel stronger, more capable and you understand on every level of your mind that procrastination weighs you down physically and emotionally and therefore your mind gets to let go now of the reasons it is trying to procrastinate. It's great that you can change. And if I help you, you'll learn this. You'll learn how easy it is to just get things done, to feel the pride, to feel the lightness. To hear the pleasure of checking that task off your list. And you are acutely aware now of the wonderfully light feelings you've experienced before when you've completed tasks and when you've achieved your goals regardless of their size. You are a competent person. You're intelligent and you know how to manage your time efficiently. And that's right. Your time is valuable, isn't it? And procrastination is a useless force that has weighed you down. So release that now. And notice when you think of others procrastinating or when you see others procrastinating or making excuses, you are actively turned off by this behavior you place great value on completion when you emerge from this peaceful, hypnotic meditation. You will emerge filled with energy, motivation, and determination. This energy of motivation and determination will remain with you. After all, when you get done with this, you'll have completed a task, won't you? And that's right. You get to already feel accomplished just by listening to this track to the end. And you can always listen to it again if you find yourself delaying. But as you listen to the sound of my voice, 
repeat after me, either out loud or beautifully let it ring as you see yourself lying there. Let it ring through your mind and your body as you repeat after me. I let go of resistance. I know I can do this thing today. I let go of resistance. I can do this now. Today is a great day, the perfect day to finish this task. I manage my time with precision. Easily I manage my time with precision and ease. I've done tasks efficiently before, haven't I? I've achieved goals and I am realistic with my goals. When goals seem large, I get to break them down so I can notice my accomplishments as I move through the process easily and effortlessly. I value my time. I value my time. I play to my strengths. I am resourceful when I manage my weaknesses. This is my truth. Good. And so it is. You are a time efficient and productive person. You enjoy the feelings of pride and satisfaction that comes from accomplishing tasks that need to be completed. You enjoy feeling physically and emotionally lighter. You feel free. The ability to eliminate procrastination from your life is an achievement you get to be proud of. And it's great that you can change. As you sit there, you can feel more confident in your abilities. You understand on every level of your mind that you do not require protection from tasks. Instead, you get to embrace them with joy and ease and solutions, don't you? You have chosen them. Everything you do is a choice and you know now you're a person who makes good choices. And as you feel lighter and more free, in a moment, I'm gonna count from one to five. And that's right. And when I reach five, you'll be fully aware, fully awake filled with solutions, positivity, and motivation, filled with determination. Number one, 
your goals become clear and your priorities are in order. Two, you are an organized person. Three, you value your time. Four, your eyes are clear and you feel the energy rising through your body as you become lighter and more motivated and your unconscious mind speaks to you about all the solutions. Five, wide awake, alert, stretching now. Stretch your body, your fingers, your toes, and open your eyes because you are amazing. I hope you enjoy this session. Congratulations on this completion. And I promise you, eliminating procrastination from your life is life-changing. Go ahead now. Do it. We know you can. Subscribe and listen to this again whenever you need a reminder of your awesomeness. Have a lovely day. You are loved. You are loving and you are lovable. Namaste.